Hello YouTube, today we are going to show how to mount a regular PC to a 19 inch tray which can then be mounted inside a 19 inch comms cabinet. So I was down at a hardware store and I picked up a couple of these. These are steel brackets. So what I needed to do first of all was to cut a small bit off this just to make it fit for the size I wanted. The dimensions that I use are shown on screen. So what we're going to do with these, we're going to use these as mounting brackets for the PC which will allow us to fit it to our 19 inch tray. So I've got two of these. And the first thing we're going to do is, because they look a bit gaudy, we're going to spray paint these black just to make them fit in a little bit better. So with my spray paint, my painter's touch, we're going to spray paint these two steel brackets. Just to give it a little bit more of a professional look. You can obviously put them in as you use, but my tray is black, so I want it to look like it fits in. So we're going to spray paint our two brackets. So we're going to shake up our Rust-Oleum and spray. I have a couple of sheets of age free paper behind that just to stop the paint getting all over the place. It's quite a bit of waste when you use spray paint, but it gives a much more professional look than if I was to paint these by hand with a brush and just regular pot paint. So we're going to leave those for a few minutes to dry. I've come back to this after a couple of hours and we're going to put a second coat on these. You can see that when it's spray painted black it just looks a lot more professional. The PC I'm using is black, the tray is black so it's better that I spray paint these black as well because it just makes the whole job look a bit more professional. Okay so we're pretty much done here. We're gonna just get the last few spots on this and let it dry and then I'm going to show how to fit it to the case of the PC. Okay so the paint has dried and I have my bracket so about midway down to the PC I'm going to drill a hole in the side of it. We're going to use a six millimeter drill bit and we're going to put a little hole into the side of the chassis. I'm just going to mark it there and now I'm going to drill it for an M6 bolt. So here we go. So once again this is for a 6mm drill bit and we're going to use an M6 bolt. M6 bolts are the same as what are used in the comms cabinet for the cage nuts so you will always usually have a couple of these around it's a good it's a good size for this sort of thing so here is my wing bolt that i'm putting through and we are going to fit our bracket to this wing nut so here is my bracket i'm going to put that over this is how to do with one hand so we're going to put a washer on it and then we're going to put a wing nut on it. Okay that was incredibly difficult to do with one hand so I've just screwed it in and this is it done. So we're using uh, wing nuts and wing bolts because they can be unscrewed by a hand which is handy in case you want to take off the bracket but this is the job of one side that's finished. As you can see it's screwed in and that mounting bracket is now fixed to the side of the PC. Okay just one other thing I like to do with this is to use a bit of hot glue and the reason for doing this is that if I take off that bracket that M6 nut is going to fall back inside into the PC. So what I wanted to do here is that if I need to take off the bracket for any reason that that M6 wing bolt will stay fixed to the side of the PC. It won't fall back inside into the PC. Hot glue is great for this sort of thing, just for holding stuff in place. It's used a lot with cables on PCs and things like that, but it's also very useful for this sort of thing. 
So because it's inside the chassis, it, it doesn't have to look perfect either. So I'm just gonna put a bit around it and that will hold that bolt in place. Okay, so now that that's done, this is what it looks like when it's completed. So we've got our mountain bracket fixed on that side with our M6 nut and bolt. And I've just done the same on the other side. So our two mountain brackets are now in place. So all that we need to do now is to take out our 19 inch tray and drill a couple of holes and screw the other side of the bracket into that to hold it in place. So let's go and do that. Here is my 19 inch tray and I've just put my PC with the brackets on top of it so I have it flush to the front there that's the position I want it on so I'm gonna mark the position where I want the bolts to go through that will hold it in that position and we're gonna drill it again with a six mm drill so once again drilling the holes for my M6 bolts and we've just put in a couple of bolts and fixed it to the tray so this is what it looks like when it's done. So I'm gonna bring this to my customer site and I'm gonna mount it in their cabinet. So that's how I got the job done. I'd be really interested to hear what everybody thinks about this. Please leave your comments below.